A giraffe's neck is its most prominent feature. It is sturdy and incredibly long. The study of its neck and why it became so long piqued the curiosity of scientists for centuries. But answering the question has not satisfied us and now we ask, why do giraffes have horns on their heads? Before we dive in, please hit the like button and subscribe to Animal Fact Channel to never miss out on amazing videos. So what do you know about giraffes? Giraffes stand tall in the animal kingdom, literally. They are the tallest animals on the planet, growing to 20 feet within two to three years of age. Their legs and necks can grow up to six feet, allowing them to reach the leaves and fruits of the tallest trees in the savanna. Giraffes are native to Africa and belong to the Graffiti genus. Their closest relative is the okapi, a zebra-like animal with white striped legs and dark brown bodies. The Graffiti genus was much larger in the past and scientists have identified 10 extinct members. But why do giraffes have horns on their head? The horns on the heads of giraffes are called ossicones. It is unlike the horns of other animals like buffaloes because it does not have a bony core. Ossicones are made of hard and tough cartilage. Ossicones are used to identify males and females. Females have narrow horns, angled horizontally relative to the head. They also have more fur on their horns. In contrast, males have larger horns that increase in size as they age. Their horns are also bald on top because ossicones are their primary weapon during fights. Giraffe fights are called necking. During fights, giraffes bang their necks against each other with great force. A giraffe neck can weigh up to 600 pounds and is used to topple opponents when necking. Necking is used to show strength between males and settle disputes. Ossicones add weight to a giraffe's head and because it grows bigger with age, older male giraffes have an advantage over younger males. Also, male giraffes that have fought many battles have balder ossicones than those that have not. Some scientists also believe that ossicones are also used to regulate body temperature. There are nerves and significant blood supply in ossicones that would make them ideal for thermoregulation, but this has not been proven to be true. So do all giraffes have horns? Both male and female giraffes have ossicones although it is absent in baby giraffes which are called calves. It has been explained that the absence of ossicones in calves is to prevent injury to the mother during birth. Giraffes are mammals like humans and give birth while standing. Ossicones on calves would cause internal injuries to the mother and this can be dangerous. Predators would easily capture an injured mother and her defenseless calf. According to International Union for Conservation of Nature, IUCN, giraffes are endangered. In 2016, only 97,500 existed in the wild, and in 2010 most of them were either in zoos or game reserves. I hope you have enjoyed this video. If you have, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and don't forget to give this video the thumbs up. And I'm sure you're going to enjoy this next video on why do snakes have forked tongues. Thanks for watching and bye for now.